This is my assistant, Al. Hello. Tonight, we focus on one of England's greatest writers, William Shakespeare. This is our exclusive, ad this is our exclusive adaptation of the Bard's personal diary, which, after being lost for centuries, has come to has come into our possession. We got it off eBay for one ninety nine. We <laughs> proved the postage. Oh come on, that's a bargain. <laughs> the life of William Shakespeare is a fascinating tale, which we shall tell to you over the next two hours. Um, one hour. Sorry, calling for a long time. The caretaker. <laughs> then we best get on with it. Let us discover the deepest thoughts of this wonderful writer. <laughs> I tried to phone you, a brilliant plate. 
more trains than the men, but our permanent home. The past few months we've been building that dream in London. The Globe Theatre. Thank you for spurs for the weather. Construction's almost finished. Everyone's working hard on the ground floor and that's grand opening. Henry V, I'll show you the globe. Wonderful. 
Adrian can climb across it by a sick pain. Yeah, this place like is messy business. When workers get ill, someone's got to clean up all the sick. How disgusting. I'll say, do you want a quid for a privy? You don't have to take this. Calm down, dear. Street, we can't pay the whole bill right now. Give two weeks and find money. I'm sure you will, madam. Where there's a will, there's a way. And <laughs> come on, Mr. Shakespeare. That was funny in one of your so Am I paying to be insulted like this? No, the insults are free. See you in two weeks with the money, plus the 20 percent. Or else. So you can't hurry and show that for one minute. Apple, and for a nice fresh apple. For no nutrition to make two maggots. Quite too many outside, too many inside. Donald. 
Thank you. 